One of the big items in that game Monday night will be can Herschel Walker break his tie with Kelvin Bryant for the USFL rushing lead. Unbelievably, they're tied right down to the yard, 713 yards apiece, and they come from pretty well the same part of the country. Walker from Georgia and Bryant from North Carolina. Well, I saw Bryant for the first time last week when Philadelphia played Oakland, and he had, a, I believe it was 118 yards, had a sensational day. Walker turned right around. He had a sensational day, and it's amazing that the two of them are tied for the rushing league with the same numbers. Well, we'll see Herschel on Monday night with uh, Jim Simpson and Paul McGuire. They take on George Allen and company. Wash. Now here's Michigan trying to get something started. First down after the punt return, the 28th play action fake. Over the late bar, hit Carter. Over the 40 to 45. Up to the 47 yard line. Anthony Carter brings this crowd to its feet here at Pontiac, Michigan in the first period with his team trending 3 0. There's what the little guy can do. A whip it. Well, there's a lot of people here have been waiting for Carter to explode like he did at Michigan. He is just now, Coach Stanley feels, learning to run the routes the way he should. That time with the play action, all he did was run a kind of a quick post move. He had to gear back a little, but 161 pounds showed some guts going inside. Carter's to the right, Holloway to the left. First down play. They run a draw play to the tail of the fullback Lacey. Lacey, a big ripping yardage all the way down to the Los Angeles 36-yard line. Ken Lacey on a fullback delay. Another big game by Michigan. Well, it was a draw. They changed up this time. They did not draw trap it, but Lacey, a steady back for them, didn't sign till the middle of training camp. Got a big hole in there. Tyrone McGriff, who joined them late, has come on. Initially, he had a muscle pull, was not able to contribute. Last week, he did an excellent job. Jim Stanley feels he is the best trapper he has ever seen. That time, they opened a big hole in the middle. Michigan has caught a spark now, keyed by the great defensive play a few minutes ago. Down on the first time in Los Angeles territory, Bear stands in there, sideline pattern, and is caught over here by Lacey, out of the backfield on the 31. That'll be a gain of about six yards. Danny Rich, the outside linebacker, makes the stop for the Express. Well, there again, showing that Bobby Bear is maturing. As he looked upfield, did not see anything. Once again, as he came off to Lacey, had a pretty good position to pick up some more yards had he not stepped out of bounds, lost his, lost his direction on that sideline. A bear out of Northwest Louisiana State that produced Joe Delaney, the great running back at Kansas City, and Joe Ferguson, the quarterback for Buffalo. Good program. Five yard gain, second and five for Michigan. Now the handoff to Lacey again, a big hole. And he hits it down to 26, and it's very close. And I believe it is another first down for Michigan. Stop us.